New tonight at six using the power of social media to create a happy ending. A local woman spent the last two years or two weeks, I should say the last two weeks thinking her wedding rings were gone and that she'd lost them in a freak accident. But then this weekend, a Facebook post about some rings found went viral. NBC Charlotte's Michelle Bowden spoke with the woman recently reunited with her rings. If you ever doubted the power of social media or if you ever questioned whether there are truly good people in this world, this is a story you need to see. Marilyn Wonderler is still something of a newlywed, married just two years, so she was devastated when she suddenly realized her wedding rings were missing. It has so much sentimental value. I, I was just heartbroken in thinking that I'd never see it again. She'd gone scuba diving, put the rings in her glasses That's case amazing. for safekeeping, then came to buy a pizza here at this Denver restaurant when she since realized the rings went missing. Pulled my glasses out in the parking lot here when I had gone to pick up the pizza and the ring went flying someplace. Heather O'Brien was at the bakery was next door just a few days later when one of her friends saw the rings in the parking lot. Sad that somebody lost their rings, honestly. I mean, I can't imagine how devastated I would be. I know the power of Facebook, so I'm going to go. I told the girls, let me have them. I'll post them on Facebook. Within days, that Facebook post was shared hundreds of times and Marilyn's husband got a call from his boss. And he said, um, Frank, you need to take a look at this Facebook posting. There is a young lady here in Denver that found a ring and who knows, it might be your wife's. Indeed it was. I said, Frank, that's my ring. That is it. They sent Heather proof and Heather even contacted the jeweler for confirmation. And then she happily returned the rings. It's unbelievable. It really is. And uh, Heather is just a incredibly honest and kind person. And I wish there were more people like her in the world. One of the rings looks like it may have been run over. There's a little bit of damage, so Marilyn's going to take it to a jeweler and get it fixed. After that, she says she'll be wearing it nonstop. In Denver, Michelle Bowden, NBC Charlotte. So 